This new suite of technologies, which are currently being integrated in a hybrid context and are being rendered interoperable so that different standards can allow these technologies to talk to one another, will begin to break down what society holds as sacred. When we look at relationships, our relationship to our spouses, our relationship to our children, our relationship to the state, and our relationship to our employers and even strangers, things will start to happen and change in a very rigorous way. We will stop trusting. We will do lookups maybe 30 times a day, just so that we know our loved one is in the right place. We may even become nervous about where our child is during the day. You know, have they moved from their classroom to the canteen? Have they ordered their lunch appropriately? Oops, I can tell from the physiological characteristics in their body that they're eating fatty foods. And what does that mean for insurance companies who may want to know, you know, how you're rehabilitating after your accident? Have you walked those 10,000 steps a day or only 30? And should I charge you a greater premium for doing so? The nearest light post can surveil what we are doing and know who we are, where we are, how we're feeling and evidence around us, you know, filming evidence around us. What it means is that we will be playing to a script. We will be going about our lives as if we're in a theatrical production because that's what we're supposed to do. Therefore, our free will is being diminished. We are doing according to what somebody else wants us to do, whether it's the government, the state, or us and our families, for instance. We lose our personalities. We lose the trust between people because we're always doing lookups on where somebody is, and we're not just trusting that they are where they say they are. So what we have is a breaking down of society's fibres, the very thing that makes society work and run and makes people happy. In effect, what we are doing is going from a satellite view through global positioning systems to a street view that we've all enjoyed using Google Street View to a people view. There are two things the microchip implants attempt to do. They attempt omnipresence and they attempt omniscience. That is, via omnipresence, the ability to know where you are, what you are doing, how you are feeling and why you are there and to actually gather black box recorder type evidence of the events taking place right now around you. This leads to misrepresentation, misinterpretation and manipulation of information inexorably into the future, depending on who is controlling the data flow and how it is being stored. In actual fact, this ubervalent society will be being played out in front of large camera screens just like network operation centres in network environments. Just like we can do lookups about where our buses and trains are in the network operation centre, we will be able to do lookups on people view. I wonder what my wife is doing right now. Let me see some footage of her while she's doing it. At any time of the day.